Thursday Night Football, and with that comes a chance to win $25,000. Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's Jason Matters with Winning Bets. Thanks for hanging out with me on this episode. That's right, it's Thursday Night Football between the Rams and the Patriots, and with that comes a chance to win $25,000 over on the Fox Bet Super 6 app. You guys know how this goes by now. All you got to do is correctly answer six questions, and you can take on that jackpot. Otherwise, if nobody can do that, they'll give away $1,000 guaranteed prize to the group people that can get the most right. We did all right last night, uh, or Tuesday night there, on that Cowboys-Ravens game of the 14 possible points. We got nine possible points right. We got that rushing total right. That one was really easy. We got the winner right, and we got the winning margin right. So just a good nine of 14 points right. Obviously, got to do a little bit better, and that's what we'll try to do this week here on that Rams-Patriots matchup, a rematch of the Super Bowl a few years ago where the Patriots pull off a 13-3 win. Much of the same is going to be going on in this matchup in terms of roster-wises. The big missing piece is obviously not having Tom Brady, but otherwise these rosters are generally have the same construction to them. So let's just jump on into this and see how we'll do it. All right, question one is what's going to be the last scoring play of the first half? Well, we look at what's going on in the second quarter between these teams. Rams are scoring 6.3 points per second quarter. The Patriots are scoring 7.4 points per second quarter. Patriots are allowing 6.7 points per second quarter, and the Rams are allowing 9 points per second quarter. I'm going to go ahead and lock in on here with the Rams field goal. I like the Rams having a stronger D. I mean, we've talked, we've made real money off this Rams team and this Rams defense, so definitely like that strong defense. I like the Rams kind of maybe scheming something up late in the half, maybe up-tempo, really pushing the pace there against the Patriots, and they can sneak in a field goal at some point late in that second half or second quarter. So that's what I like there. What's going to be the first TD of the third quarter is question two. Well, the Patriots are scoring six points per third quarter. The Rams are scoring 5.8 points per third quarter. The Rams are allowing 2.5 points per third quarter. That is remarkable. And the Patriots themselves are only allowing 4.8 points per second quarter. So if you see that, not a whole lot of seven pluses right there. Not a whole lot of touchdowns. I'm going to go out on a limb here and say no touchdown or any other touchdown. And I took a lot of flack for giving this exact same pick of no touchdown or any other touchdown on Thanksgiving Day between Washington and Cowboys, and we got it right. The research paid off that day, so it doesn't mean it's going to pay off today, but the research worked that day. The research today says that there should maybe be no touchdown in the third quarter. Two really strong defenses going out. Obviously, they come out strong in the second half, so I'm going to stick to the research here again and hope we get no touchdown or maybe even a defensive touchdown. I mean, look how strong both of these defenses are. Special teams units with the Patriots last week, so give me no touchdown or any other touchdown. All right, question, uh, what is this, three, four now, is uh, how many different players are going to score a touchdown? Well, the Rams have 10 different offensive players have touchdowns so far in the season. The Patriots have nine offensive players have a touchdown on the season. I'm going to go ahead and answer this one, four. This one is a lot of luck to me, so I'm just going to lock in on four on this one. The next one we got here is total points over under uh, is 44.5 in this game. Got the Rams number two ranked defense, Patriots number 12 ranked defense. Just a few years ago, they played to that 13-3 game in the Super Bowl. I'm really expecting a lot of the same. Give me less than 40 points. I don't. I, I just can't see a whole lot of points being scored in this matchup. So I like less than 40 points. The next question here is the team with the most offensive yards and how much is that amount going to be? Well, the Rams are allowing 291 yards per game, while the Patriots are allowing 344 yards per game. The Rams are getting 395 a game, and the Patriots are getting 342 per game. I'm going to go ahead, too familiar. Again, this this is the same scheme here. I'm going to take the Rams here. I'm going to take zero up to 340 yards is how I'm going to answer this one. We talked about this on the on previous episodes. This is where, guys, you got to figure out once you handicap this game and you finish capping it, it's how do I think the game's going to go and all the questions have to follow suit. So obviously I see a nice defensive struggle here. So obviously I don't have a lot of yardage. So I'm going to go ahead and that's why I've got it there at zero to 340. And question six is always, what's the winner? What's the margin? You can probably guess by now I'm on the Rams. Again, we've made a good amount of money on real money betting on my daily sports betting show here on backing these Rams. So I'm going to go ahead and do it again. The Ram, there, the line is currently Rams minus six, but I like it a little bit less than that. I see it closer. I'm taking Rams to win the game, but it's only going to be by three to four points. 
That's how I'm going to round up my chances to win $25,000 on Thursday Night Football between the Patriots and the Rams. Go ahead, guys. Like this video and share it with your friends so we can all win that money together. Let's uh, all, all just, you know, share it all up together. <laughs> all right, guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next contest. I'm Jay Sabatis. Thanks for watching this episode of Winning Bets. I'm Jason Mattis. I'll see you again when we are celebrating the wins and making more winning bets. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe for more winning bets.